Hi, I'm Edie. I'm Judy. And, and together, together we're the Rainbow, Rainbow Grannies. Grannies. Yay! We were out and about, and we were given this flag. And when we asked about this flag, they told us all about what this new flag means. So we're going to be able to tell you all about it, too. Hey, oh. Let's see, do you two even have disagreements or arguments argument. on how to resolve it? Sorry, didn't want to get to, oh, you can oh, get personal. You can ask those questions, you can that's ask, what we're here to You can ask anything that. except for, you know, about that, you know, nasty stuff, you know, because, right. and what, really, what goes on in my business, in my bedroom, you don't even want to know, because it's two snoring, sleeping old ladies. So, so do we do have... have little disagreements, but it's not, yeah. it's nothing, you know, bad. I mean, we don't scream and cuss at each other. You know, we were talking about this yesterday. Basically, whenever we get upset with each other, we kind of walk away. You know, yeah. just go away, yeah. get a little bit of air, breathe deep for a few minutes, and then that's it. You know, because when I get mad and upset, and if I take a few minutes and rest and stuff, I think about it and I think, wait a minute, just settle yourself down, Edie, because... I am blessed to have Judy in my life and to have someone this wonderful and having such a good time. So just settle myself down. And that's what I do. Yeah. And if there's anything with Edie that, that might irritate me. <laughs> so, she doesn't even know that there's anything she does that irritates. She didn't even know. I don't bother to tell because I thought, well, over 60, this stuff isn't going to change. If, if, if Edie was doing anything that hurts my feelings, then I would have to let her know because she doesn't want to hurt my feelings. And the thing with me, if I hurt her feelings, she doesn't want me to do that. So we've got to let each other know because we've only known each other not even 10 years. You know, we're still learning about each other. Plus, people change. And so whatever might hurt my feelings now didn't hurt my feelings five years ago. People right. start to change. And it's not a deal breaker, you know? Right. Like, you know, we're, we're both uh, in monogamous relationships, but... We both do have eyes and that's a lot of fun because we can both share the fact when we see somebody that looks handsome or pretty or whatever, you know, we don't have a problem saying, oh my God, did you see that girl? <laughs> One day, I can't remember where, where we were, we, oh, she was in her car and I was in my car and we mm -hmm. were talking on the phone and we were stopped, we were driving home or something and we were stopped at a red light and I looked over and I saw this girl that was like almost naked. Remember, I can't remember mm -hmm. what she had on. She was almost naked. And I said, Judy, to the left, look. And she looks over and everything got quiet in her car. Because <laughs> she didn't know what to say, you know. And it was just like, oh, my goodness. You know, the, I mean, the, hey, I couldn't believe the girl left home like that. I felt like she <laughs> must not have a mother. Or, you know, <laughs> and her friend lied to her. When her when she said, "Hey I girl," yeah, we she talking. said, "Hey girl, does this outfit look nice?" Yeah. And her friend said, "Oh, you look so good." No, no, your friend lied. She lied to you. You look like a hoochie coochie mama. <laughs> awful, awful. You know, you don't give up all that up for free. <laughs> that girl should have been charging. But I do want to say something else. What? This is us now, but and so I don't want to, you know, it got easier now because of the age we are and and we've made our changes already in past relationships. We've learned how to be in a relationship. We've learned how to communicate and all of that. But it doesn't mean that's where everybody is right now. Right. I want to say this that you know, people say, Oh, communication is everything. But then but then what does that mean? So what I've learned is what keeps the relationship strong is that you respect each other is different. You respect you're different from one another. Because a lot of fights and arguments is because somebody wants something one way and somebody else likes it another way. Well, it's okay. You can be different. And then you've lived in a, you live in, together, you gotta make compromises. It can't be all one person or all the other person. But this is a real important thing that I learned that I think it, it, it's tough in relationships. Is when you have when you're so angry at each other that you stop talking, and then it goes for a day, and it goes for another day, and then Ooh. it starts. We you know whatever with a small hill has becoming a huge mountain full of boulders. How do you break that silence? And what you do, you know, I get weepy. Is Aww. you do something nice for the other person, and that's all it takes. Yeah. 
Let's see. Entertainment What's the yellow done? with the circle in? Yeah. You know, I did you say that you think it means all inclusive? Somebody told us all inclusive. I yeah, think. we asked we're about to, it. We're gonna have to look that up too. We just saw this for the first time this year. A couple of weeks ago or right. so when we were out, they had these. Right. And so they gave us one of these. So mm -hmm. it's it's the new one. You know, the flags are always updating, just like people. We're always right. changing we're and always updated. Because there was a time where there was not a thing as like um, well, when we were young, all there was was gay, straight, and bisexual. Right. Now there's pan and and then asexual, and yeah. you're talking about trans and non-binary and, and right. uh, aromasexual. I don't know. Yeah. But there's so many I, different things. Yeah. So, so or, Because there's more that, and more we've learned about ourselves. You right. know, it's because, not that yeah. people are any different, because people are the same people they always were. It's just that we're learning different, fa different things to call the people. People are coming out realizing there's a different people, piece of them. They're not right. just bi. They're right. bi and they don't want to have relations with anybody. That right. means they're asexual. Well, no, asexual fall in love with people. They're just not sexual. Right. Right. Which is really hard for me to understand, you know, which, yeah. I mean, it's okay. Everything's okay. Look, gender fluid right. and asexual right. are the Class thing. Classified as intersex. Or a thing oh, okay. Symbolizes wholeness, completeness. And our potential. Thank you, EE. E. Yes, thank okay. you so much. Oh, yeah. Did you know the heterosexual community has a flag of their own? And you know, that kind of no, reminds me. That kind of Ooh. reminds me when I was a kid and we were celebrating Mother's Day. And I told my mom, we got Mother's Day and Father's Day. When Children's Day? She said, every day is Children's Day. <laughs> and I'm thinking, but I don't get a present every day. <laughs> every day is Children's Day. So hey, that thing seems really redundant, doesn't wow, it? Wow, that's funny. Okay. So I can't, I got to look that up. I want to see what the, what the, what do you call it? An, uh, the heterosexual flag looks like. We should mm -hmm. get one, though. You know, we can wave it, too. Because we're supportive and inclusive in everyone. <laughs> you know? Let's see. It reminds me of a Sephora bag. Real creative. Let's see. Yeah, it is black and white stripes. <laughs> I got to look at it up. Let's see. I wonder how many heterosexuals are upset with that. I wonder it how many like a, know. It sounds like a homophobe idea. You yeah. Know? How many male and female. Know? Black and white. Why are you trying to change <laughs> stuff? What is all this nonsense? <laughs> <laughs> I think that those are the colors you wear in jail too, aren't they? They used to be. Yes. And we have a little bit of creamer left from where we yeah. went on our vacation, and I've been using it. You, yeah. You've been using it too. No, I haven't. You've been, been, been leaving it for it. me. Uh, uh, anyway, I've been, I've been using it. I've been using it. I wondered why it lasted so long. Yeah. And then the, the one from um Hawaii. from Hawaii, because we were in Hawaii, and somebody asked you, right, to bring you some coffee yes. from Hawaii, because they knew about it, right. and that it was really good. One of my co-workers. And so then we thought, well, we may forget it for ourselves, too, if it's so good. Right. Onto that trip. Do they carry coffee pots? Yes, they do. I saw that. But what we put our link to, I guess we could branch out yeah. or whatever, but we yeah, put we our, put our, yeah. We make put, it easy. We put it for the ground ones, because that's what, you know, Judy, put a coffee Judy gets in there and she we, grinds yeah. it. She grinds those coffee beans and makes it really good for us. So, you know, and uh, click the little bell. Hey, all you guys, please yeah. click that little bell so it'll send you a notification when we put that video up and everything. Yeah. It's just, well, anyway, we're out.